The Magic Paintbrush Long, long ago in Ghana, there lived a poor boy called Kujo. He loved drawing. He was too poor to own a paintbrush, so he used a stick. He would draw in the sand or scratch marks on the wall. One day, when Kujo was by the river, he saw a large silver fish trapped in the reeds by the river bank. The fish was struggling to get free. Kujo felt sorry for the fish, so he helped release it. Later that day, Kujo was sleeping. In his dream, a mysterious man dressed in a silver cloak spoke to him. You are a kind boy, Kujo. I am giving you a magic brush. Use it to help the poor. Startled, Kujo awoke and lying beside him was a paintbrush. Kujo was amazed with his gift and thought how he could help the poor people. He painted a donkey for a young mother to ride. He painted an ox to help a farmer pull his plough. He painted a hoe for an old lady to weed her garden. Every day he found a new use for the paintbrush. The emperor heard of Kujo and his magic brush. He sent for Kujo and ordered him to paint a field of golden corn. Kujo didn't want to obey the greedy emperor, so he drew a sea with a tiny island in the distance. Where is my field of gold? shouted the emperor. Just here, replied Kujo, drawing a tiny field on the island. Paint me a boat so I can travel to the island, snarled the emperor. So Kujo painted a boat and the emperor climbed in. Kujo drew the north wind blowing towards the island. I'm going too slowly, roared the emperor. Paint a stronger wind. Finally, Kujo drew, drew a storm. The waves grew higher until the boat capsized and the emperor disappeared. Relieved, Kujo drew a white horse and rode home to tell his friends what had happened.